Yo! And welcome to episode 8 of UIM Post Max Progress. Nice to see you. Welcome, welcome. I'm Petrowski, or Pat Mousty, or Cringe Trowski, whatever you want to call me. Hello, hello. What's up, what's up? I think we're just doing more barrows this video. You know, big surprise, doing some barrows, but we're starting at 170 KC, and all of the items you see in my inventory are all of the items we've gotten so far since round 38 or 39 KC was our starting point, so. That's everything, and then these runes, and then the 72 bolt racks, yup, yup, yup. I don't have the Mauritania Horror Diary, so my runes are not 50% increased, for those who didn't know that, because uh, I hate questing, big surprise. It's funny, I've actually never done Ghosts Ahoy on any account. I have two maxed accounts now, a main in the UIM, and I've never done Ghosts Ahoy, <laughs> which is really funny, but anyways, off to Barrows. Yo, Guthin's Helm, that's a nice item, cool, cool. Oh yeah, this is the fit. Rocking it. Okay, yo, yo, yo. After doing a lot of thinking of considering what items I want to keep for now, what items do I for sure want to keep for long term, what items do I want to temporarily keep, um, all these items referring to Barrow's equipment and Barrow's armor, if that wasn't clear, uh, I think I'm, I think I figured out at least what I'm doing with these, these pieces of my inventory. So, First things first, Guthans. I think I'm going to be bagging Guthans temporarily and maybe <clears throat> trying to get the full set and like use it some, but then I'll probably just end up outing it. Honestly, I want to just get a full set of Guthans to be able to like AFK Gargoyles for like an hour to like remember how shitty it is and then just out it. So <laughs> I want to just like get that nostalgia and get that, you know, that like feeling of wanting to do that out of my system. So I'm going to be bagging the Guthans. In terms of the Arums, I already have an Arum's top in my bag, so I'll be dropping this over to a friend uh, on a main account, and then I'll be alking the Arum's hood. I definitely don't need full Arum's. I can see myself keeping like the Arum's top and bottoms for some sort of PVM if I need them. I'm going to be alking the Arum's hood right now. Rest in peace. It looks so fucking cool, though. I should have worn it beforehand, but that's okay. And then Derek's plate body is definitely a keep, definitely a bag. That's like the set where I'm the most going for at Barrow's. Uh, and also all carols. I'm going to be keeping all carol carols for now and all Virax. So literally the only thing we're getting rid of are we're outing the Arum's hood and dropping the Arum's body over. So I'm going to try to do this really quick and hopefully no one scouted me. I'm like doing this very slowly, <laughs> which is funny. The use option is just three clicks down instead of uh, two. Yeah, wow. Instead of two like I'm used to, because it's Barrows and it has the check option for the de the degradation, the degrading, the de yeah, that word. So yeah, here's, here's everything in the bag. That's really cool to look at. It's really cool to see. Well, it's, it's just cool to feel like I have a bunch of, like, PVM armor, even though I don't, like, you know, even though I really don't, because it's all not that useful, right? And I don't do a whole lot of PVM. It just feels good, okay? Um, you know, I'm trying to feel good where I can, dude. Come on, dude. I'm trying to, trying to... Fake it till I make it. Fake and live in the life of a UIM PVM chat. Anyways, I'm gonna go drop this to a friend. See you guys later. Much love. See you next Barrow's item. We're at 175 KC, by the way. Okay, cool. Ooh, and there's a Verox Flail. That was a quick little. That was a Verox Flail back to back from the. I think the Guthans Helm was the last piece. Yeah, for sure. That's crazy. I think I have three out of four Guthans pieces now. And if I get the. Or not Guthans, Verox lol. I think I need the Verox skirt. Yeah, Varric skirt, then I have full Varric, which is super sick. I actually really want full Varric because I'd love to be able to like do certain worldy bosses and just like risk it and not care. I might want to do some more sa like safer bosses before that, but I'm not sure. We'll see. Hmm, we're lagged. Dragix? <clears throat> Huh. Okay, Jagex servers, yep. <laughs> Jagex servers seem to be turbo lagging at the moment, so I'm gonna be taking a quick break, go play some Skyrim or something. Sounds fun to me. Wait just a second. Is this the boy? Blood Drain 202? Blood Rain 202? That's really crazy. What are the odds he's here? For those who don't know, that was a dude that I saw at like a progress video or two ago. At like uh, shooting stars, he was at the um, what's it called? I'm on the right thing. Not used to that. Okay, he was at the like the Zaya mine, like the Arceus 
Arceus Runecrafting, and he, like, called a shooting star for me, which is really cool. I, it's really weird that, like, the same dude who was doing shooting stars is also doing barrows at the same time I was doing both of the as activities on the same world. Obviously, it's 415, so usually people who are, like, high total level kind of, like, home this world. But at the same time, like, I don't know. That's pretty crazy. Like, what are the odds that person is doing the same activities and being, like, the same order? That's really funny. And playing at the same times. Shout out to him. He's a gamer. Yo, yo, yo. It's a late night. I think it's, like, 11 p.m. on Sunday night. And me and my friend have decided to do a Barrows competition. Race to 200 chests, 200 KC. So that's going to be starting tomorrow at around 8 a.m. or something like that. We're not sure quite yet, but something like that. Um, this is going to be K... KC200, and the reason this is important is I'm going to stop here for a little bit so I can get like an even 200 KC flat to like do the race, right? So then I'll be able to, I'll know that the, the, the race ends on 400 KC. So here's the last chest for tonight and for a little bit. No drop. I've been dry for a little bit, but I've had so much luck up until this point. So no complaints. Super lucky still. Super happy with Barrows. Super comfortable. I'm excited to do a race tomorrow. I haven't done a competition in like let's see, a long time. So I'm not going to take it too super seriously but at the same time i'll probably still game like 10 plus hours a day so i'm excited maybe i'll do more we'll see motivation always hypes me up so see you then raids are crazy i would love to learn raids one at some point for sure i'm just like scared because it's like a team activity and i'm ooh, very t uh that's a duplicate but it's an item that's cool to see um i think i just elk this I don't know if I drop it or elf it. Oh, I elf that for sure. That's super worth to elf. Er, actually, I think I'm going to keep all Verox duplicates for now. Because I want to use my Verox set to fucking um, go in the wilderness and kill Callisto. <laughs> so I'm just going to like perma risk. Like, Ver if I get like two full Verox sets, that's like two deaths at Callisto. So. Yo, yo, yo. I'm not sure what kill count this will be. I think it's like 222-ish, maybe. Let's see. Yeah, exactly. Nice. Cool. Uh, but I've been doing the... So I started the competition with my friend. Although I haven't even seen the vlog in yet. So I, I don't know what's going on. I don't, I don't know like if they're okay. I hope they're okay. You know, um, hope we're gaming. hope we're still competing. But e either way, I'm still going to be like gaming really hard and doing a ton of barrows today. That's my goal. Um, I could technically do... I've been maintaining a really good number. It's all been maintaining like 12 to 13 barrows per hour, which is like I'm pretty happy with. As, as Even though I'm matched with like this, you know, with my meme gear... Uh, I'm pretty happy with that, with no, like, DDS, you know. Uh, I did get one item, as you can see. I got the Varus Brassard, which is super cool. It is a, it is a uh, duplicate, but it's honestly, like, a one of the better duplicates because I would love to get multiple sets of Varus. Like, if I can get, like, two sets of Varus before I get my first set of Varus, I'd be super happy with that. I would love to do, like, Barrows long-term and get multiple sets of Varus because being able to, like, risk sets of Varus in the wilderness to go do Callisto... I'm, like, super happy to do that. Like, that'd be super fun. It sounds super fun to me. I'm really excited to try it. I hope it works out well and isn't just, like... I hope it's, like, not impossible for me to solo... So, to solo Callisto. That would be the frustrating thing. Um, but I would love... I'm really, really excited to get, like, a couple sets. Probably just, like, two. Maybe one like one or two, right? Of Verax and go Rister Met, Rister Met Callisto. That'd be super fun. Death Pile and then go pick that up and pick up some food and go try to kill it. But anyways... I'm gonna keep killing barrows. Try to stay. I'm gonna try to stay at, at least like 10 plus chests per hour. But I'm gonna be like, like long term. That's like you know pretty chill. I've been killing for about two hours or so today. Uh, it's around. It's almost noon now. I woke up at around 9:30 or 10 and started gaming. So, yep. Pard pard. See you the next drop. Ooh, that's my first piece of Torags. Nice. Torags play body. I think that ends up probably just being an Alf. I'm going to keep it for now because it's, it's a piece of a set. And I want to keep going until I get a full set. But that's super cool. Nice, nice. 168k Alf is also super nice. So, dope. Yo, yo. My Triton's sitting at around 81 charges. So I'm going to squeeze one more kill out of this thing and then recharge it. Ooh, an Elite Clue. Nice, nice, nice. Hmm. I'm actually not sure if I can dig in this clue spot, but all I can do is go test it. So, see you in a sec. Yeah, it needs partial completion of uh, Darkness and Hollow Veil, which also will require any of the Meyer keys. So, that's a drop. That's okay. Back quickly to Barrows.
fuck. Well, I forgot about my trident charges, and I just sat there hitting Derox for a couple seconds without realizing my <laughs> weapons at two. So now I'm gonna recharge it. That's will be. This is the end of the second full trident of arrows. So I'm moving on to the third full trident of arrows. Okie dokie. The third trident's fully charged. Time to get back to arrows. Nice, Torag's Helm. I think that's a new piece, right? Yeah, nice. The last two pieces have been Torag's Helm, Torag's Play Body. Awesome. Those look fucking dope, too. I shouldn't get hit, did I? Yeah, I'll recharge them. That's okay. Some really fucking cool looking armor, though. Yo, 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 Petrowski here. Just had Death and Helm on exactly kill count 250, which is really cool, which also means I'm 50 kills into this competition slash race to 200 Barrows chest with a friend. Um, it is just a duplicate, so it'll probably just get out or dropped over to the main for GP for bonds. So, still cool to see. Still an item. Uh, 250 KC, which is super dope, too. Nice. See you next item. Is that a third Guffin's Helm? We got spiky helm boys. That's crazy. That's actually pretty funny. Damn. Fuck. You guys can see that perfect timing on that prey range and into the elite clue. Nice. Let's see if I can complete this. I've had a lot of rough luck with them, but it's mostly my fault for the lack of uh, quest done. So, yep. See you in a sec. I literally had like. I think this is like the third clue step, yeah. Every single one prior to this step, like the first two were both like late quest requirements that I like did have. Um, and this one is one that I don't, and it's uh, Sins of the Father for a music track. So it's like, elite clues suck, dude. Elite clues <laughs> seem to like fully revolve around quest, and like I'll have like five of them done, but then like the one will just always bite me in the butt. I literally just want to be able to do like one elite clue, like that'd be sick, but. Uh, baby rage never lucky. Good luck next time. Oh, that's fucking sick. Yes. Oh, that's fucking awesome. Yes. Second Darius piece. I have that collection log pop up now too. I just turned that on. I didn't know that was an option. Looks good as fuck. That's sick. Now I have Derek's uh, plate body and plate legs. Oh, that's actually so fucking good. Yes. Woo. Okay. I need axe and Derek's helm. Sick. Fuck. <laughs> That's a third arms top. Third, three arms tops. Three Guthans helms. We're in the rule of threes. Honestly, it's a fatty GP drop though, so fair enough. That's fucking good memes. Rule of threes. Here we go. Next kill. Yo 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 yo. Sick item. Varex skirt. I think that completes Varex. I think that is one full set of Varex. And the sick thing about Varex skirt is like. That's an item that I want to keep for other stuff. Like, I would use that at, um... I think I would use that at Gargoyle Boss for Test Guardians. But yeah, that's fucking awesome. I think it's the first set complete. I think it is, which is crazy. Yeah! What? Sorry, I'm in fucking disbelief. That's so... Wow. Holy fuck. And I was 10 HP on that run, and my... <laughs> my defense cape perk and my max cape TP'd me out. Oh, that's so fucking incredible, though. Fuck, that feels so good to complete my first Barrow set. That's awesome. At 278 KC, I don't know what the, I think it's, I don't, I don't know what, like, the rate is for, like, when you're supposed to complete your first set, but that's awesome, super, super happy with that, love to see it, see you guys when I complete my next set, nice. Yo, dare I to play legs, it is a duplicate, right? Yeah, I had to think about it for a sec, but I definitely knew it was a duplicate, but it's a DH piece, which is cool to see. Yeah, nothing crazy. Next piece time. Yo, yo, yo. <clears throat> Towards the end of day one of the 200 Barrows KC race, um, I have some sad news is that my friend who I was going to race actually had some stuff pop up in life. She had a very big emergency and just had a, had a really rough time, so she is not going to do the race. But I'm still, like, competing. I'm still, like, doing a lot of Barrows. I'm still going to try to aim to do, like, 200 Barrows within around two days. So today's the end of day one. It'll be around 2, maybe the finish it the third morning or something like that. We'll see. But 
the reason I'm making this clip, and first thing first, is that I need to clear out my inventory. I have a ton of items here, as you can see, and I don't need to keep any, like, loose items that I won't be keeping anymore just to see if I can get the full set to be able to store it in the stash unit temporarily. So, for example, that basically means Torags. Um, both the Torags pieces will be getting out. Goodbye. I've shown all really quick because it looks very handsome. Handsome, tough fella. Goodbye. Rest in peace, Torag's helm. Rest in peace, Torag's plate body. And then, as for everything else, I think I'm bagging everything else. What are the Guffins peddler? I think everything else either gets dropped over to a main for GP, or kept for personal UIM use, right? Like, things like the, so like the dupe, Derek's plate body, something that's like 600k versus like 165, right? I'd rather just drop that to the main, um, for, for GP, if I'm being honest, because I pay for all my membership with bonds, and getting GP on my UIM is just like not an issue, like I don't really need GP for anything right now. I would like to get a ton of GP eventually for like fletching, but I think I literally just have enough for like all of the arrow shafts that I have. I think I literally just already have enough GP for that, so... I'm not, uh, yeah, I'm not worried about, like, the couple hundred K or whatever that I'm on this from this. I'd rather, I'd literally rather just, um, drop it over to a main. So I'm gonna be very careful. I probably should be boxing skeletons for this. I'm not deep enough in the wildy. I probably should be boxing skeletons for this because this is, like, a lot of stuff. Thankfully, okay, thankfully it's one click to put those away. That's super nice. My inventory thing's full off that. Wow. Okay, I should have bagged a little differently. That's really funny to see the... Two here, two here, and the one up here. That's really funny. Oh, that's cool. But yeah, that, wow. It's funny to see my <laughs> my looting bag is just like entirely full of uh, Barrow's pieces. That's really funny. Huh. Neato. Okay, well, now I can go back to Barrow's. See you guys soon. I might have to end up dropping that stuff eventually to like really clear up my inventory. If I like, like if that's, the next time I fill up this inventory, I'll have to just go suicide like a spory and like really drop it over and stop stalling and being lazy about it, but. Anyways, back to Barrows. See ya later on at the very, very end of day one, hopefully getting around 100kc, or the start of day two. So, see you soon. Ooh, Elite Cloak? Okay, we'll take it. What is that, like two, yeah, 298kc? Sick, sick. Okay, I think I'm just going to finish the last two kills that I plan to do for today to get 100kc for the end of day one. Before I even attempt the elite clue, then I'll attempt that as the last thing I do before bed. That'll be a good way to wrap up the day. Nice. Okay, this will be chest 300 for kill count 300. I did 100 kills today alone, which I'm really happy and really proud of. I might do a couple more after I attempt the elite clue. I probably won't, but it's possible. Um, I'll probably just relax, watch a little like Netflix or something, and go to bed. But here's KC 300. Ooh, we get an item. Okay, it's a four P. We've <laughs> had. It's the fourth Guffin, Guffin's Helm, but that's really cool. It's awesome to get a, an item on 300kc to end the day and the first night. So, yeah, Barrows has been super fun. Yeah, nice. See you uh, tomorrow morning on day two of the 200 Barrows and two days grind. Hmm, this clue is tempting slash weird. So, for this, I need Shazian favor, which... Something that I would be willing to grind, I think. The only issue being that I still want to finish this race and just focus on Barrows really hard, and I don't think I want this in my inventory taking up a slot during that. Um, I'm trying to debate whether this is worth keeping or not. I'm on step 5. I might keep this, because it might motivate me to do Shazian... I'm not sure. I think I'm gonna end up dropping it. I think I'm. I think I think I'm just gonna drop it. Um. Yeah. Because I would need to get like seventy percent Shazy in favor. Maybe it's worth to keep. I'm gonna keep it for now. I'm gonna stop being a stinker. I'm gonna keep it for now. We'll see. Okay. Okay. Fine. Quit begging. One more kill at the end of day one to see if we get a back to back. We actually do get a back-to-back. -back. Fuck. Well, now I gotta go for the triple. <laughs> and it's an arms pop. Which is, like, another, like, three-peat, I think. Okay, well, now I gotta do one more. Fuck. Well, see you in a sec. Okay. 
Here's <laughs> kill 302. Looking for the three Peter. If I can go to bed. Okay, I can go to bed. Whew, released. Okay. Good night. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Yo, yo, yo! It's the start of day two. I actually just fully recharged my trident because I think I was starting my first kill of the day. Or my second kill. I think it was the second kill of the day. And my trident died. So just recharged that. Ready for a full day two of hopefully aiming for 100 bears chests. But we'll see. See you next item. You're it. Okay, an item, Varric's Brasser. I think that's like the third Varric's Brasser, but oh, ooh, it's on the floor. I need to fucking drop shit. Huh. I almost TP'd out without it. That would have been bad, though. Honestly, it's fun. So that's an item. That's my third Varric's Brasser, but I, I'm super happy to get Varric's duplicates because I want to be able to get. I, I Ideally, I the best duplicate is Varric's because I want to be able to get multiple full sets of Varric's so that I can go do like Callisto and just like risk. Varax sets. Um, the plan would be to like suicide and pick up like my Varax and like some sharks and like go try to, try to do some Callisto. That sounds like fun as fuck to me. What have I been lying for? Hour and 20 minutes? Ooh, okay, we're chilling, we're gaming. Item question. Ooh, okay! That's a new item! Ooh, collection log! Woo! Okay! On 320 KC? That's actually cool as fuck to see. Poggers, woo, that's cool! That's sick. I don't know if- I actually have no idea if I keep this item. Okay, fuck. That's a duplicate. Oh, that sucks. That kind of stings, because I really need other Darax pieces. I really need the helm or the axe. Oh, man. But it's a dope item. I if I got an item that fast. Fuck. That stinks. Mmm, mine runes. Oh, I reached over 100k mine runes! I didn't even notice. That's actually kind of cool. I actually like that stuff. That's. Oh shit! Oh shit, oh shit, that completes Carol's. Oh, that's actually a huge item. That's awesome. It has the collection log too. 342kc. That completes Carol's. Oh, that's fucking cool. Oh, that's cool. I don't think it matters. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think it matters, but it completes Carol's. That's really fucking cool. I'm really happy with that. Nice. Yo, what's up? I actually just suicided to Hispori because my inventory and my looting bag were completely full with Barrow's items and other stuff, so I'm going to have to make a lot of decisions. And basically figure out what I'm dropping over to a main to sell for bonds, and what I'm keeping, and you know, what I'm bagging for now, what I'm keeping temporarily, etc., etc. I can store full uh, Verax in the uh, in that stash unit, which is super cool. So I do need to get that and go build that stash unit and do that. So that's super exciting. I can store full Verax for now because that's a set that I for sure will I for sure will keep for the time being. So, but yeah, I'll get back to you guys when I really figure out more of what I'm doing and I have some more like stuff to show for it, you know? So, see you soon. Okay, how cool does this look, though, with all of the Barrow's armor that I've gotten so far in my inventory? That's sick. Here's the Broken Arms robe top from super early on to the account, but yeah, I don't know. I think it's super cool to see this, so I wanted to show this off. That's all, all of the pieces so far. It's, it's looting like that arms hood and some stuff that I've dropped in Elf, so. But yeah, it's cool to look at, you know? Cool to see. Aesthetic. Okay, so after some careful planning, I think this is what I'm working with. I think everything on the bottom here is a drop. So there's two um, extra Derox pieces. It's funny that I have four Derox pieces and like, they're the same pieces. That's funny. So these two are going to drop because they're just extras that I don't need. And they don't really out for enough to make it worth it. Like if it's 800k to a main versus 168k to a UIM, I think I'm going to just drop it. Some people might hate that, but I'm going to drop it to a main for bond money. And then um, the Guthans Helms are all going to get dropped. I kept one for full Guthans for a little bit if I want to just meme with it. The Carol's Coif, although it completes Carol's, I just don't need it. I'm going to drop it for sure, I think. Um, well, maybe I need to think about that a little bit longer. I think it's a drop. No, that's a drop for sure. I'm pretty sure. Um, the two arms tops are going to get dropped, but I'll keep the one, the one full one. And then everything else on the top row I'll be keeping for the time being at least. At least for now. I might end up alking the, the Carol's Crossbow is an item that I would alk, so I would alk that. 
keep all the Varax duplicates. I want to store one full set of Varax in this dash unit and then keep, yeah, everything else. So I think that's it for now. Top row keep, bottom row out slash get rid of. So, yep, see you when I'm cleaned up. Okay, not going to lie, I'm going to be a stinker and drop this elite clue. Please forgive me. Okay, yo! Almost done cleanup. I put most of the stuff in my bag already, although there's some, uh... Oh, well, at least all the barrels pieces in my bag. It's a bunch of stuff I still need to put, like, all, you know, my normal gear, right? But I'll get that sorted in a second. I'm almost done cleanup, but I have decided to out the Aram Staff and the Kells Crossbow. So, I'm going to say rest in peace to these two items. It was nice getting them. It was nice to get my collection log. It was nice to complete them. I just don't think I'll use them. I have Trident and I have Rune Crossbow. And it's just not worth the inventory slots. So, yeah. Rest in peace. It's nice to have them. It's cool to get in the log. Yeah. Rest in... Rip. Okay, yo. I'm mostly cleaned up now and can kind of go back to Barrows. But I'll be doing a jank Barrows kill, as you can see. I need to do a jank kill so I can look at this fucked up inventory. I need to grab a spade. That's funny. So I can uh, build the stash unit with these items. The hammer, the saw, the nails, and the planks. So I'm going to do a jank run to build the stash unit and then place four pieces of these Varrocks in there and then I'll bag the other two Brassards. So, yep, that's the plan. I'll let you know when I'm done with this jank run and bagging the Brassards. Yo, yo, yo. I wanted to record the uh, jank kill just in case I got an item because that would be too fucking funny to pass up. So I have no run energy so I have to walk to the chest to go. Let's record it. Yep, nothing cool. I just, I just tellied out. I forgot what I was there for. <laughs> God damn it. I forgot to build the stash unit. I just completed the kill and tallied out like any other kill. I guess it's muscle memory, so it makes sense, but... Oh, that was dumb. It's no big deal. Time to do another kill. <laughs> I hopefully remember to build the stash unit this time, so... <laughs> yup. Okay, okay, okay. Stash unit, stash unit, stash unit. Remember to build the stash unit. Stash unit, stash unit, stash unit. <sighs> okay. What am I missing? Oh, I need a gold leaf! Oh my god! <laughs> Fuck! How did I forget that? <laughs> I need to go get a gold leaf. Ah. <laughs> okay, we acquired our gold leaf. Jank kill attempt number three. Okay, I'm just gonna build this dash unit, put my Varix in it, and have no more jank kills. Okay. Whew! Full Varix. In the stash unit. Okay, awesome. We can check this kill. Fuck! <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I mean, that's awesome. That's a sick duplicate. Okay, we're halfway to a second Varric set. <laughs> God damn it, that's funny. <laughs> Fuck, well, yep. Ooh. It's an elite clue. Man, it's like an hour and a half of recording for no drops or anything. Got an elite clue, though. That's something. Hopefully I can do it. Maybe we'll do one of the elite clues by the end of this grind. Maybe. I don't know. We'll have to see. Uh, it's a deep, 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 wildy clue. It's hard to click on because the X is in the way. It's the agility training arena in the wilderness, so I'm probably going to drop that. I could suicide and probably go do it. But I just don't want to. I really just want an elite clue that I can do easily, but that's why they're called elite clues. So, whatever. I'm going to keep crying and go back to Barrows. Another day, another trident charge. Time to buy a bunch of fire runes and charge it for the fifth time, I think. That's crazy that I've used five tridents in like under 400 KC. But yeah, time to charge it up. It's an elite clue. That's something. I'm like super dry of a drop. I think I'm like. Three or four hours dry, something like that. 391 KC, so I'm like, I am almost done the 200 barrels KC in two days challenge and race that I'm trying to aim for, so I'm very happy with that. So, yeah, see you guys when I see if I can do this elite clue. Yep. Okay, on second thought, I think I'm just gonna keep this elite clue until I'm done. I mean, we'll tell I'm at 400 barrels KC and then I'll do it then. Because I don't really wanna try to do it right now, so yeah, I'll do it in a second when I'm done the 400 KC. Whew, yo, <clears throat> Whew, well, here it is, the end of kill count 400. It's a Varix in Tunnel too, which is actually my favorite Burroughs Brothers to get in the Tunnel because you can't really pray against him anyway because he hits through prayer a lot of the times. 
so it's not really used to pray against them, so you never need prayer when killing them. They'll just be like high HP, and I can just tank them. You know, it's no big deal. Um, but it's been, dude, it's been a long two days, dude. <laughs> That's what I can say. Doing 200 barrows KC in two days has been a long two days. Here's the last chest. No item. 73 death runes, of course. Um, <laughs> it's been a lot of fun. I've really, really been enjoying barrows. I'm going to take a short break for sure. And I think go fish some, like, minnows or something like that. But this will be one of the last clips in this video. And this was a long video. This was definitely my longest video by far. And probably the most, like, gameplay effort I've put into the video. Not in terms of hours, but in terms of, like, it's up there for hours. But in terms of, like, effort, you know, like, PVM, even though it's Barrows, like, you know, it's, it's, you know, not what I'm used to. It's something that I wanted to do and I really enjoyed doing. But it definitely takes a lot more out of me than, like, AFK and Blood Runes, like, 16 hours a day, right? So, but it was, like, it's been so much fun. It's been so, so, so much fun. Um, and I can't wait to do more Barrows soon. But I'm going to go take a small break and fish some minnows while watching some anime or, like, chilling out. I'm taking a small break, you know, a small diversion from PVM. So I'll see you in a sec when I have some more gathered thoughts on how to end this video and, like, how to thank you guys and just... Yeah. Okay, first things first, before conclusion of the video, I want to check the collection log and show off everything that I've gotten at Barrow so far. So, bit of duplicates, 18 out of 25. That's actually crazy. Wow, I did not realize... I didn't realize I was that close to, like, completing it. I guess it's, like, not that close to, like, getting those last couple items or, like, the hard part, right? But, like, I don't know, I feel like 18 out of 25... After 400 KC is really good. Maybe I'm wrong, but I feel like that's pretty fucking lucky. Um, like full Carols, full Varax, four arms tops, almost full arms as well. Just missing the robe skirt. Um, half of Guthans, half of Torides, half of Darox. Four Guthans helms, three Brassards, two Varax helms, two Guthans plate bodies, two Darax plate bodies, two Darax plate legs, and then four arms tops, as I said before. I'm really happy with that. I feel like that is a really fucking solid 400 KC. I'm really, really happy with it. I can show the items that I've kept so far. So I'm keeping all the Varric pieces that are possible. I kept both Guthans pieces so I can like AFK for a little bit and meme with those. Do my use out of those before I feel comfortable dropping them. Uh, Derek's of course. Carol's I do want to keep. I might do some, I plan to do some more Kraken, which is, I, I thought I would never do again on this account, but that's a future plan that I now do want to do again. So I kind of miss, I miss PVM. There's not a whole lot for me to get at Kraken, but it's just fun. Like, it's, it's just fun, and I want to do it, so and I miss it. So I'm going to do some Kraken on the UI in the future. Um, I think that's everything, all the Barrows gear that I've kept, the collection log. I might go do this Elite Clue. I might start the next video with that, something like that. I don't know. We'll see. But, yeah, it's been a great video. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of effort, a lot of mental grind, a lot of physical grind. Um, I've had a fan running for most of the, like, last half or, like, some decent part of this video because it's very fucking hot it's very hot in my place my ac always tends to break this time of year um so i'm sorry about that but you know what we deal with it we live through it you know we, per we par prosper on you know do whatever we need to do but anyways thank you all for watching thank you so much i know it's been a really fucking long video if you've made it this far i there's no words that i can say so like thank you enough you know but thank you i really fucking appreciate every view every comment Every interaction, every like, every subscribe, you know, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Twitch. I stream, I try to stream, you know, three hours every day, but that definitely doesn't happen. Two, two to three hours every other day, something like that, you know. Try to stream a bit. Um, follow me on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, sub me on YouTube, sub me on Twitch. Blow me a kiss, call me cringe in comments, you know, whatever you need to do. I appreciate you all so much. I hope you have the best fucking day. I hope you have a great day in RuneScape. I hope you have a lot of fucking fun today, and yeah, thank you so much. Good luck in your journey. See you later.